And we are underway. Season 9, inaugural race of Season 9 SRL. Of course, it's uh, the standing's a little funky, at least on my end. We'll have Logan Orend in P1 there, you see. Getting the over overtake early here into turn four. A little bit at the curb there for Logan Orend. He comes around five, six, and seven. He and Simon Mara already with quite the interval over Freya Balai. They are on the hard compounds, so I don't think they'll fight Belay too much. Meanwhile, Lewis Marshall must have been an incident back there. As Lewis Marshall found himself tumbling down the standings. And DRS is enabled. Our top three very close to each other. Simon Mara, Freya Belay in DRS range. Alexi Koivuniemi just behind them outside. And I think a, a picture we will be used to seeing. Logan Oren, Simon Mara, Freya Belay on screen all at the same time. Behind is 12.0 seconds. Meanwhile, Alexi making the pass on Van Gelder. A little bit of a moment there for Van Tink. And at the top of the table, Simon Mara. Not only did he get past Logan Orend, but he's actually pushed to get Logan Orend outside of DRS range. And as I mentioned that, we will have a safety car. As Robin Hertzstadthagen. It seems is out. So an un unfortunate there for Simone. Simone Mara looks like he has a restarted. And a good restart for Alexi Kwebiniemi. And Nick Van Gelder going inside. A little contact with Freya Belay. Koivinami also pushed out a little bit. And the track limits there for Senna Hervire. Simon Mara with a gargantuan restart. Already getting Logan Orend out of DRS range. Tim Ventink go for an overtake here. He does, he goes inside. Nice driving from both drivers, allowing space. Tim Ventink gets the move done. So Tim Ventink started pretty far back in the grid. Ooh, you see a little bit of opposite lock there, it looked like. But Tim Ventink doing well, making his way up. Still fray up. Going to, uh, he's not gonna just lay back and do nothing. An easy overtake there with DRS. But you so for Jaegerstrom, still gonna have the DRS. Van Gelder did not go in. Going for the overtake on the straight. Nice and easy. But Van Gelder, and they go side by side, too wide through the S's. Van Gelder's going to take it back. Boy, and Jaegerstrom is really pushing for it here. Goes for it into the hairpin of turn eight. As you see, Simon Mara coming out just behind Logan Orend. So a successful undercut for Logan Orend, but... Simon Mara, of course, going to have fresher tires. And I 
did see the lights flashing behind Mara, so I think the ERS... Ooh! Logan making the overtake there on turn 14, I believe, technically, but you see eating a little curve. Mara looking to the inside as they almost appear to be going three wide, but Mara backs out. Mara able to get the overtake, and now these two can really battle. Simon Mara on the straight. Meanwhile, Simone Mara on the straight with DRS. Able to get the move already on Logan Orend and with fresher tires. Going to be difficult for Logan to find his way back. And a virtual safety car. This could really alter the strategies. Vincenzo Torre, unfortunately, having to retire. And now this has really thrown a kink into everyone's strategy. Those huge intervals about to be erased. So bold decisions for Dion Saw, and it looks like they're going to pay off. And was that a little faint for a pit stop from Simon Mara? He certainly has the tires to make it the rest of the way. Of course, now Logan's going to have the tire advantage. Freya Belay stays out. And there he goes. Great start for Mara. Belay not quite ready. Meanwhile, Alexi on the faster compound might have the overtaking opportunity already. Belay goes a little defensive. Oh, in contact. That is Dulis. No, it was Dion Stahl. Unfortunate. It was a Ferrari. And Dion Stahl. And another car wide. It looks like a Williams. And we'll have another safety car. Logan Oren going inside. Dorman also. Dorman getting the pass on Logan, but Logan going to have the line, I believe. Yes. Perhaps more contact in the back. Dorman really falling to the back of the grid. You know, Alexi trying it on turn four. Not the best exit for Belay and Alexi. Quivinemi perhaps not, not satisfied with just a podium. He wants to challenge Mara and he'll have the ability. And Belay, another wide line. I wonder if there's damage. But Belay falling behind. scored 
as Logan Oren makes the pass for P2 on Alexi. Simone Mara comes around, turn 14, turn 15. And Simone Mara, for the fifth time in five races, will have a win in the SRL League. Great race from Alexi Koivuniemi to finish P3 and Logan Orange, last year's champion in P2.